Hello class, welcome to the Minute Math YouTube channel. Please hit the subscribe button below and share our videos. You can also find great math content and links to all of our videos at www.minutemathtutor.com. All right now, enjoy the lesson. Hi, I'm Sean Gannon and this is Minute Math and today we're learning about adding and subtracting fractions and mixed numbers. I'm going to evaluate each expression. So, if I was given this expression, negative one-third plus three-eighths. So we have negative one-third plus three-eighths. Well, the first thing you should see here is that these do not have the same base, okay? So we can't add them directly right now, but we can make them have the same base. And my little technique for this is I just take the base here, um, the first base, and the denominator, the first number, and multiply that over itself to the second number. Then I take the second number, which in that base is 8, and multiply the first number by that number over itself. We all know that a number divided by itself is the same thing as 1, so we really don't change this problem at all, just the way it looks. So now let's simplify. 8 times negative 1 is a negative 8, and 8 times 3 is 24. Plus 3 times 3 is 9, and 8 times 3 is 24 as well. This always gives you the same base, which we need to add these two numbers together. Now, bases are the same, and that was the whole point of that, right? So 24 stays there. Now we just add the numerators. Negative 8 plus 9 is a positive 1, so we have 1 right there. So now we just have 1 over 24, and it is already simplified, so that is our final answer. So quick recap, we're given negative one-third plus three-eighths. Well, they don't have the same base, so we make them have the same base. Multiply three-eighths by three over three, and negative one-third by eight over eight. That gave me negative eight over 24 plus nine over 24. Then from there, I, we have the same denominator, so we just add the numerator. We have a positive one up top, right? Denominator is still 24, so one over 24 is just our final answer. Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, the creator of Minute Math. And if you like this video, please hit the like button that's right there. If you have a mathematical question, just add it to the comment section below. And lastly, if you want to see more videos just like this one, hit subscribe. It's right there. But as always, thanks for watching.